Today, we're going to take a look at and rig up our new ready to fish trout combo. We built the entire ready to fish line of products to help families catch their first fish together. We've been the experts at family fishing kits for over 20 years, and we feel this new kit is one of our best yet. From the streams of the East Coast to the Great Lakes to the rivers in the West, trout are sought after by anglers all over the United States. Whether wild or stocked, trout are beautiful, strong, and abundant across the U.S. When you hook into a trout, get ready, because you're going to see that fish do everything that it can to set itself free. It will try to take you into the rocks, the woods, and maybe even out of the water. For these reasons, trout are the most admired cold water game fish in North America. Our new western style trout combos features a 7 foot fiberglass rod and a size 30 reel. Our eastern style combo features a 6 foot ultralight rod and a size 20 reel. Both are pre-spooled with line and each combo includes a hand-picked assortment of some of the most popular and relevant lures on the market today. All of this packed into one convenient tackle kit. Before we get rigged up, let's take a minute to go through your ready to fish trout kit. We'll show you the selected assortment of lures that we've handpicked for your fishing needs. Spinners are extremely versatile. You can reel it in at a fast or slow pace as needed. They work especially good over the top of shallow rocks, rapids, or current seams, or deeper along the bottom of pools. Simply cast it out and reel it in at your desired speed and depth. Spinners usually catch more fish when retrieved downstream or with the current. Of course, you can also catch fish casting across the current or even reeling back upstream, but day in and day out, downstream retrieve catches more trout. The plastic tubes and grub bodies pair perfectly with a jig head. They are the perfect option when fishing for trout in slower rivers, deep pools, or lake settings. Thread either body onto the jig head like so. Simply count these down to the bottom and retrieve with either a slow and steady pattern or hop it across the bottom for a more aggressive presentation. The float and hooks are great for live bait. Trout love, and I mean love, night crawlers. But please check to make sure bait is legal for use in your trout stream first. Many states allow fishing with worms. In a river, simply cast a baited hook or treble hook snell into a pool and allow the worm to drift naturally. In a lake, be sure to use the float as trout are often feeding near the surface. Now, let's take a look at the trout nuggets. We've added a pack of chartreuse scented trout nuggets. These will be most effective when fished in lakes or rivers for stock trout. The bright color and enticing scent is sure to get a response. They work great when attached to a jig head or hook. Now that you know all about your kit's contents and how to use them, let's rig up our rod and tie on a lure. You may first need to remove the protective plastic wrapping around the line. After that's out of the way, with your kit removed from the rod, open the bail wire on the reel and allow the line to move freely through the guides. Thread the line through each guide and leave a couple extra feet of line at the end. Flip your bail back over and tie on your bait of choice using your favorite fishing knot. Now that you're ready to fish, where should you go? Trout can be found in almost any body of cold water, lakes, rivers, streams, and even your neighborhood pond. Early morning and evening are typically the best times to catch trout, although they can be caught at any time of the day. Many states have special rules and regulations to protect wild trout populations. Please be sure to check these regulations for your area with your State Department of Wildlife. While you are looking at the regulations, also check to see if your state has a trout stocking program. Many states in the South have stocking programs in the fall, winter, or spring. These trout are stocked at a good catching size and are intended for put-and-take fishing. They won't survive the warm water temperatures of summer, so feel free to keep a few of these trout for delicious dinner. When fishing for trout in rivers and streams, look for current seams where fast water meets slower water. Trout will often hold in these points, just waiting for a morsel to drift by. Other likely locations include any obstruction to the river flow, rocks, logs, and in some places, weed beds create these ambush points that trout love. And one of the best parts about chasing trout, especially wild trout, is that these fish tend to live in beautiful locations. 
To survive, they require clean, cold water all year long. In the mountains, this comes from snow melting purified by mountain meadows. Here in the Midwest, the best trout streams flow from icy cold springs which flow through the beautiful valleys. So when you go after trout, be sure to take some time in to enjoy the wilderness where they live. For more instructional videos and other great how-to content, check us out on readytofish.net or find us on YouTube under Ready to Fish.